started. We shall see. Looks like uh, a good start. Everyone loves mudkips. So, let's see what they can do for me in this battle. Shall we? An unpheasant, a blissey, a deoxys, a drapion, and a crocodile are in my team. All, uh, quite different Pokemon. I've got quite the range here. I know what I should do, but I, I think he's just going to switch out on me. I don't think he could hit me in any way, but I'm going to go for the superpower. Ooh, ooh, hidden power. That's okay. These things happen after all. So that's either electric or grass. I wish I could know, because if I knew it was grass, it's probably. No, oh yeah, it's probably grass. It's probably grass. I'm gonna send out on pheasant. Is that hidden power? It's gonna hit me. Oh, it was electric. That's okay. I called wrong. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose on those types of guesses. It's really one or the other. Um, water having only the two weaknesses, grass and electric. If I had thought it was electric, I would have sent out crocodile and not just, you know, negated the damage entirely. But, c'est la vie. Um, what to do in this position against a rock type? Not generally the best situation to be in. I'm gonna do a quick U-turn and get myself out of there. I think uh, Crocodile. Yeah, Crocodile will tank whatever he was gonna throw it on Pheasant. Okay, so he's probably not gonna eat it, but I'm gonna... Oh, oh. So I should have just used a solid earthquake there. Now I will. Yeah, okay. I expected her to uh, pull in the rug and roller when I sent out the quick ball. The pursuit would have hit them. Regardless of switching or not. The logic might give me some trouble here. Now if memory serves, Lissy is a special defense tank, so whatever Melodic is about to throw at me, Lissy can take. Oh, and it was a hypno hypnosis anyway. Alright, we can deal with that. We can deal with that. That's alright. Lissy can have a nap. Throw down a toxic. Absolutely perfect. Don't think Melodic has any real physical attack power. I don't know what the rest of his team is like at all. But, you know, I'll adapt when I find out. I'm gonna. gonna protect I think because he's gonna throw something at me. Okay. Let's uh, get a toxic on that one too. Probably gonna take out my blissey here, but yeah. Okay. See that was a bad call on my part. I should have thrown down the toxic instead of protecting. But you know you can't always know. Can't always know, bro. There's a Pokemon I wish I had. Slow bro. Sorry, not no bro. Good to help me out here. I mean, Shu is a fighting type, so I gotta try to deal with that. I do have a Deoxys, so I don't know uh, what my problem is. And a non pheasant, but non pheasant's got the normal type. And apparently, my uh, Deoxys has Stealth Rock. Would have loved to have noticed that a little while ago. That's that's for sure. Um, th 
throw down a bit of stealth rock. That's alright, that's alright. I can uh, I can take that. No, wait, no. Well, stealth rock only goes once. I don't believe you can can throw down more than one stealth rock. Yeah, okay. Ooh. I'm gonna use a cycle boost. I greatly misunderstood how to use that ability. Okay, so that's what happens when you don't read the uh, descriptions of certain powers, you know. You miss out on such things. I thought that was to raise my user special attack, and I skimmed through it. But I'm gonna throw a fire punch at him. Still gonna hurt him, because I am Deoxys after all. I'm gonna throw down a baton pass. Okay. You know, I'm, I'm in a good state right now. He's got two Pokemon knocked out. Um, two of them are hurting. One of them is poisoned, one of the ones that are injured. So, not too badly off right now. I'm gonna whip out a Thunderbolt, probably faster than a Lapras. Not gonna do much to a Lapras, but you know, all they could do rather than switch out and get hurt a lot. Whip out my Mudkip, actually. That's a good idea. Superpower. Give him another superpower. Make Mudkip really work for it this time. Oh, uh, of course. Still hurts quite a bit, though. Still hurt that mean chow. Alright. won't survive that, yeah. That's okay. It's a fighting type. So, you know, when in Rome. I hope I'm faster. I don't know much about this mean Shao. I barely know that it's a real Pokemon, but I'm pretty sure it is. I believe it's from Gen 5. I just, I have never used one. But, you know, here we are. Pluck is really my only choice, so. Didn't think I was that much faster, or I don't mean faster at all, really. Lapras. Lapras. Definitely an ice beam coming my way. Now, knowing that, there's nothing I can really do to minimize that, so I'm just gonna hit as hard as I can with the return. Oh wow. Okay, whatever drill run is did not affect me. Not, not sure if I've ever heard of that move, but glad they used it right when they did. Uh, Milotic, once again. Just looks like he's rotating through his Pokemon. Kind of in a state of panic, I think. Um, I know I'm not that much better off than he is at the moment, but I think it's just the state of mind that they're playing in. They're constantly trying to react to what I'm doing, rather than approaching me with a strategy of their own. I mean, you need to react, of course, but it's all they're trying to do is react. They don't, they don't stick and run with it at all. And, you know, sometimes you have to. You can't just swap out, otherwise you'll be hurting yourself more than you're helping most of the time. Um, probably another ice beam coming towards my way, but I'm probably faster as well. Oh, I'll recover. i recover when she has uh, a toxic to melodic isn't going to help her much. Especially when I can just throw another return her way, and she'll be just about as bad as the situation as, as she was before. Yeah, see, and now I can finish her. But rather than that, no, I probably should, because if I don't, she'll hit me. Yeah, definitely a return. 
could have wished, maybe uh, ensured some health for my unfuzzy, but I don't think I need it. I think I've got this in the bag at this point, not to sound arrogant, but they're both pretty low. Lapras is at 9, Miles almost not knocked out. 9% on the Lapras, I mean. Should be faster, so I see no problem here. I think this is a, a win. A win for Team Arc, if you will. With the extraordinarily ugly bird. I'm not a big fan of uh, this Pokemon. I mean, it helped me out this time. Yeah, okay. Lapras got knocked out from the Stealth Rock. And that is how things go sometimes. GG.